too little, too late. This is a comment that reflects how so many people are feeling right now about the news of recent changes to safeguarding in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints here in the United Kingdom and hopefully these changes that will be rolled out across the world. You're absolutely right and you're not wrong to feel this way. As 21st century saints, one of the major concerns we had about these changes were how people were going to feel who have contacted us as victims or who are who haven't yet come forward with their experiences, we were really concerned that you would be feeling betrayed, heart let down, that this is not enough and certainly that this should have happened such a long time ago. You should have been kept safe. You're right, you should have been. What I would say is that these changes and their evolving changes will keep people safe now. People who are currently engaged with the faith or who may be in the future, this is going to help. And for those of you who should have been helped before now, for those of you who have already been hurt, we haven't forgotten you and we will continue to work to make sure that your voices are heard and that your experiences shape the evolution of safeguarding in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Now, we absolutely commit to that. And if you need to reach out to us for any reason at all, we would love to hear from you. But your pain, your anger, it's welcome and we honour it. Whatever your experience is, we bless your journey. <laughs>